Hey guys, and welcome back to my channel. So in today's video, I'm going to be talking about my current favorites. Of course, all affordable, and some of these products are new products that I discovered, put them to the test, and they improved, so I thought I'd share them with you guys as well. So if you guys are interested, then let's just go ahead and get started with the video. The first item I want to talk about is this Aqua Assurance Compact Foundation. This I definitely have used and abused. As you can see, I'll definitely hit pan. This is the second one that I purchased and it's basically a powder foundation. So I set my whole face with this after I put my translucent powder under my under eyes. I love how the finish looks on my face. It makes it nice and smooth. And this does a good job to keep me matte throughout the day for a few hours. And this also helps when I am wearing a mask and, and the makeup on my nose rubs off. I just use this and I use the the sponge that it has in it and I just put a little bit of product in it, tap it a little bit and it fixes my nose makeup and I just love how this thing works on my skin. They have it at ulta.com and they have it at Jcut's website but I would say give it a try. This is a good everyday foundation. Even if you don't want to wear, if you don't want to wear foundation, just wear this powder and it'll do the job for a good amount of hours. Okay, now I have this Soul Body Bronzing Balm, and I have the shade Light, and this is so nice on the skin. It smells so pretty. It smells so good. It smells like the lips, knickers, little lip balms that I used to use when I was a little girl. I heard this is a dupe for the Chanel bronzer one. I've never got that one. I've never purchased it, so I wouldn't know. I wouldn't pay that much money for a bronzer, but if it says... Any as good as this, is this is definitely worth the price. It's not even half, it's, it's half and half of the price. If I have it under my bronzer today and can't wait for summer to wear this all over my body and just be bronze and tanned for summer. Definitely been loving this so far. Speaking of the body, I have this Airspun Loose Face Highlighter and I have this shade Snow Mudge Ice 100. I think it's the lighter shade. I don't use this on my face because, like I mentioned in my other video, I have oily skin and I don't like to emphasize my texture and I know this would help me do that. But I use this on my body. I have it on my shoulders today, a little bit on my neck. And this is so pretty, it's so affordable. Even sometimes I'll use it on my inner corner to make, have a little pop of color on my eyes. And they do have other colors, but this one I just thought I'd, it looked better for my skin tone. But definitely can't wait for summer as well to be putting this all over my body and be glowing all day. I wasn't going to mention this because I don't have this currently, but this ColourPop Pixie Puff Highlighter is so nice. The packaging is so nice. I had to get it because of that. I love it so bad. But they do have the Bambi one right now on their website that just came out. I love these kind of little body shimmers because I feel like the big ol' puff in here works so well. Especially for summer when you just want to be all bronzy and glowy. This is such a nice color. And this is such a nice color. And I know the Bambi one is just as pretty. And but I just thought I'd mention it real quick because it's just so cute and pretty. And if you can get the one in ColourPop's website right now, then definitely get that. But this is definitely a good alternative. And like I said, I'm wearing it today. And it definitely does the job just as good. Okay, now I have a blush, and I have this Elf Bite Size Duo, and this blush I wear every single day. It's definitely my everyday blush. I haven't even hit pan, and I've been using it every day for $3. This is definitely worth it. I don't, I don't really wear the highlighter, but the blush I wear every single day. And I have the shade Spiced Apple, and I know they have other shades, but I can't put this one down just yet, so... Maybe in the future I'll get more shades, but for now, I love, love, love this color. Okay, lashes. I have these Beauty Creation lashes. These are 3D foam makeup lashes, and these are so affordable, so nice. Is what I'm wearing right now. I have the shade Classified. I love Classified. And these are just nice and wispy, not too dramatic. It's just the perfect amount of drama, and I love it. Love these. I love the price. Can be and I'm going to be purchasing more styles because I have loved these so far and I have used another pair I forgot the name of it but I've used it at least 10 times and they're still going strong I can't believe how affordable they are and how many times I'm going to wear out of these so if you take
take good care of them. These will last you a long time as well. So, okay, now I have this ColourPop BFF Cream Gel Liner, and I have the shade Get Paid. This is definitely my everyday eyeliner for my waterline. It has a little bit of shimmer, like metallic, but I think it's so pretty. Like I like, I love how this color makes my eyes just pop a little bit. That little metallic sheen gives it a little pop for everyday natural makeup. Just uses on the waterline, and I just love how it looks. And I know they have plenty of other shades, but these are like my everyday shades that I wear, and love, love, love this. Okay. Foundation. I have this Catrice Cosmetics HD Coverage Foundation. It says it lasts up to 24 hours. It's mattifying. Water plus sweat proof and second skin effect. And I seen all the claims on this and I was like, okay, put it to the test because of, you know, what's going on with the mask. And it has worked. It has worked so well. And I definitely, when I put this powder on top of it, my makeup stays locked for a good amount of time. And yes, you know, every now and then, you know, my nose gets broke off, but like, I mean, it's meant, it's, it's bound to happen with your nose, but this foundation has worked well. I have the shade Nude Beach, and definitely passed the test, and I'm glad I picked this up. Okay, a little bit of everything. Now I have a sponge. I have this, and this is Total Face Sponge by e.l.f. I have so many of these in my collection, and sometimes I get a little lazy to wash them all, so I... Purchase the duo, I believe it's $8 for two. I mean, it's such a good affordable price, and these sponges are like so well. I have so many of them, and like I mentioned, if something works so well at the drugstore or wherever, if it's affordable, wherever you may find it, like, I think it's definitely worth it, and this is definitely my everyday sponge, my go-to, and I've been using this for months and months and months. Love this sponge. Okay. Now I have a brush cleaner, and it's the Sonia Kashuk Makeup Brush Cleansing Spray. This thing works wonders. Literally used it today. I use I use it every day. Like when I'm doing my makeup, I just spray my brush and I just whirl it in a paper towel, and it's dry within seconds. This thing is like magic. I love this. It's my it's definitely my favorite makeup brush cleaner. And I found this at Target and. It's eight, they have a eight dollars and they have a taller one, they have a bigger one, and it's a little more money. But this will last you a while, and this is definitely the best brush cleaner, in my opinion. Well, well, that was it, guys. That was all the products that I had for you today. All these products that I have put to the test, I had a little bit of everything, but they all work so well. Definitely recommend you guys get your hands on these things, they wouldn't, they won't let you down because I know I put them to the test and they have worked well. So if you guys like this video, definitely give it a thumbs up, like, and subscribe, and I'll see you on the next one.